The Make Noise Richter Wogglebug is a streamlined update of the classic design. It builds on the original wired Wogglebugs and the previous Make Noise Wogglebug, and is the most powerful, compact, versatile, and playable Wogglebug yet. The Wogglebug is a random voltage source, but unlike most such modules, it is far more than a set-and-forget generator of random numbers. At every stage, it is designed with interactivity in mind. Interactivity with the musician playing it, the system in which it resides, and even within different elements of its own psyche. The Wogglebug's panel is divided into three sections, each with its own output type, audio, control voltage, and clocks. Inputs are on the left, audio outputs at the top, and voltage and clock outputs on the right. The clock section has two panel controls, two inputs, and a button. The internal clock rate goes from very slow, over a minute per pulse, up to low audio rate. There is voltage control over the clock rate, as well as an input for clocking the sample and hold circuit from an external source. The button causes the sample and hold to hang. Note that the internal clock output stays active even when the clock input and button are being utilized. This makes the Wogglebug available as a master clock even when being manipulated by the outside world. The clock is very stable at all rates. With the clock stopped by a dummy cable in its input or running at a slow rate, we can use the button to move the Wogglebug along manually. This way we could get a new random value at each press of the button and let it hang indefinitely. With nothing in the clock CV input jack, its attenuator adds an additional offset to the clock rate control, allowing it to clock to nearly 200 Hz. The burst output emits random gates, whose frequency and rhythm is affected by all other settings of the Wogglebug. There are several stages of random used to produce the variety of CV outputs available. First there is a stepped random source, with a control balancing it between ego and id. Without anything in the ego jack, this output is a self-contained system. As we turn down the balance, the output range lessens, and patterns may begin to emerge in the randomness. All the way down there is no output. The ego input allows the Wogglebug to be used like a sample and hold. With the balance all the way to ego, we sample the input at the Wogglebug's clock rate. The ego can be gradually overridden by the balance control, adding randomization to the sampled values until it is completely random at full id. The button is always available to freeze any value we like. The smooth CV output follows the stepped random at a slew rate set by the clock control, so that the faster the clock, the less time it takes to catch up to the stepped random. Clocking the Wogglebug externally allows us to set the slew rate independently. The Woggle CV output chases the smooth out, and when it catches up, it woggles, a behavior that is best understood by hearing it. As we turn up the woggle size, the woggles increase in size until they are large enough to slow down the whole output significantly. The woggle output is also affected by the influence input. Here's a simple cycle from maths so we can hear its effects.
Depending on settings, we could use a different voltage source like this cycle in the ego input to hear a sort of superimposition of two predictable contours onto the random outputs. The Wogglebug also has three audio outputs that are affected directly by all stages of the circuit. The smooth VCO is a new shark tooth waveform that is also affected by influence. The Woggle VCO is a square wave, and the middle output smashes the two together for the sound of a screaming big monster. These outputs have a rough sound, because they represent the raw psychology of the Wogglebug, and might benefit from processing such as filtering or low-pass gating, perhaps using the related CV outputs from the Wogglebug itself as modulation sources. With its ergonomic layout, immediate tactile control over the clock rate and sample and hold, the constant availability of the master clock even when the system is suspended, and the influence and ego inputs providing unique ways to process and influence other signals from the system, the Wogglebug is the most musical and playable random generator available. It is easy to morph its behavior from subtle inflection to total chaos and back. Visit makenoisemusic.com for more info.